Welcome back, everybody. Yay. We've uh, made some adjustments. Steve got back to where he was. Ha. And uh, we're going to see how episode two goes. Whoa. All right. Thanks for coming with me on this trip. Wow. I'll understand Whoa. if you have to take a break at yeah. any point. Yeah. Just find a safe oh. place to stop and quit the game. Don't worry. Yeah, this feels I'll way better, Tom. Always. Cool. Even glad that it worked. Like now, now it feels like I can only just yell at the game for having shit controls. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. Well, you gotta always start with the basic God, stuff. You gotta yell it. at the, uh, the hardware. Free yeah. game came out in 2002, titled Sexy Hiking. No! <laughs> mysterious check designer. Yeah, you gotta you gotta start off with the basic stuff, Steve. Yeah. You yell at the controls, the games are like the the, the hardware, <laughs> and then you go to the game. Very quickly and, and then once the game has been, 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 been determined to be bad, you yell at the designer. The yeah, they're built more for the joy of building them than as polished products. No, I knew that was gonna happen. I don't know why I did it. No, no, please, 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 climbing god. Yeah, yeah, oh, I'm climbing master. Look at me go. Oh, I'm so climb. <laughs> I'm a speedrunner! And it's one of the most unusual things I've ever done. Oh! You have to ask to simply drag yourself up a mountain. That act of climbing in the digital world or in real life is the game to play. Stop, bad hammer! No amount of forward progress. The mouse pets are moving away from me. And the player is constantly, unremittingly in danger of falling and losing their body. No. <laughs> no. We. <laughs> what is happening? Anyway, when you start sexy hiking, right. you're right. standing next to this dead tree <laughs> that blocks Boy. the way Boy. to the entire rest of the game. Yeah. It might take you an hour to get no. over that tree. Oh man. No. You never got past it. A prod and you poke at it, exploring yeah, the limits of your reach. No, and you ah, trying we got to find this. a way up and up. over. And there's a sense of truth in that lack okay. of compromise. Okay. Fine. Yeah. Most see, now I feel like whenever I fuck up, it's my fault. No. Yeah. Completely confident in your ability. That was. Oh. I knew that was good. What is happening? What is happening? Oh. Just by spending enough time. That's. You okay there, Steve? I have learned that when I get super. No. <laughs> <laughs> when I get apparently stressed out in the game, I turn into a gorilla. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> oh. Oh. No. Oh, we're back here. Don't it's let fine. it get to you, Steve. It's fine. it's fine. No, it's fine. You know what? I'll just bring my home down here. This is it's a good place to live, right? Yeah. You, got, like, you old... can make a little home there. Yeah. You got the water next to you. You have like a little rock for a house. I know, right? It's pretty nice. Yeah. Come on. Bring us around. And nope. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's fine. Mm -hmm. That's fine. That's exactly what I wanted. Yeah. Come on. You know what I'm surprised is that the, the character doesn't just like bash his head in with that sledgehammer. God, I know, just right? Just give in. Ugh, what kind of world do I live in? Why am I in this cauldron? Why am I a man in a pot? Does he just not have any legs, do you think? I don't know. Nope, okay. I don't know if it's a matter of he doesn't have any legs or he's like... one with the pot. Uh, maybe he's like one of those things where it's like you are what you eat. But did he eat a pot? Or, did he, or is he a pot that ate a man? Uh, maybe both. Maybe it's a man who ate too much pot, and mm. the pot ate too much man. No, no, no. And they tried to eat each other. It wants to do that, too. Like, it just wants you to, like... Oh, yeah, uh, he slowly, like, I don't know if it's, like, intentional, but it's like he gets tired and slowly starts to descend backwards. If, well, you, if you don't have, like, constant resistance against it. Well, it's also a matter of, like... In this this part right here specifically, uh -huh. like the whole time up, you do this particular movement mm -hmm. that uh, to get yourself up there, the the, the half moon spin. Well, it's like a oops. This thing that we call failure is not the falling down. Man, the the push off is weird because it's definitely like intentionally. Way more force from the the cauldron man than from the mouse inputs. Uh huh. No. Anyways, 
Um, no, when you're like when you're scaling this, there's a there's like a particular muscle memory motion that you can do. Oh yeah, the, that gets the, up there. The technique. Yeah, but then as soon as you get to the top, mm -hmm. like that house there. Yeah. If you do that, that's where it throws you off. You're like, oh, you're doing this thing that I've taught you to do this whole time, and now I'm gonna punish you for it. Uh, that that that's true. Set down. Makes you always want to click, doesn't it? Yeah. All right. All right. Let's just set her on down there. Yeah. Then yeah. Pull on. Oh, so I can't. Okay. So I can't just. Can't just do that. Nope. Let's, let's bring us around. Come on. Bring us around, Captain. Uh -huh. See, and then sometimes when you're like, when you try and push off, like when uh -huh. you legit, like intentionally try to push off, it doesn't put as much force behind it. It's like the game is specifically designed to be the most awkward and unintuistic, untuistic, untuistic, <laughs> untuistic. That's a great name. No, no, no. Uh, 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 Alright, 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 alright. Alright, 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 alright. Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, I'm not good at the push off yet. Yep. Cause like I don't understand the the push off force mechanics. Okay. That didn't work. <laughs> I feel like I need to get better at the push off. Uh, nope. Okay. Come on. Bring it. In. Bring it. What are you doing? We're bringing it in. Stop thrusting it out. And push. See, look, I can't get the push right. I'm not sure. I I'm, never. I never got the push right either. I'm not sure what I'm doing wrong with the push. I don't know. Come on. Come on. No. No, that's not what we want. That's not... What are, you, what are you doing? What are you doing? He's just following your mouse commands. No, he's not. <laughs> yeah, he is. It's just really badly, badly, badly done. You can hit the escape key if you need to change the mouse sensitivity. You want me to change the mouse sensitivity, Steve? No, this, this overall this feels good. Oh, there we go. All right, we're back. Now we take it slow. Yeah. Take it. Woo! Alan! 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 No, 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 no. Hey. Gotta do the flicky. What you doing, Steve? I'm trying to bring the hammer around the other side. Uh huh. Yeah, come on. No. Look here, buddy. Just get us up there. All right, all right. No, it's fine. It's fine. You're right. You're right. This is my fault. This is my fault. I'm sorry, Cauldron Man. This is my fault. All right, let's do this. I believe in you. We can do this. Here we go. Ha chow! Nope, that didn't. Well, okay, okay. Oh, hey, hey, hey. No! Oh! Oh! I don't want to be on that house again. No! 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 no please! 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 Sir. No! 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 I don't want to go down. I don't want to go down. No! We've come too far. We've come too far. Don't get turned, Steve. Hoo-hoo-hoo-wee! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> no, please, 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 master. No, 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 please, please. Going down the road no, feeling no, bad. No, 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 <laughs> no, I don't wanna. I don't. One down the road feeling bad. I'm going down the road feeling bad. 
Speaking of yodeling, have you seen the uh, that new video that came up on Netflix recently? Uh, it has no. Jack Black in it, and it's called the Ki- the Poker King. No, that sounds Appa- awesome. Uh, apparently, it's based off of a true story of some guy who accidentally like uh, extorted a bunch of people in his business or something like that. And uh, it's it's super interesting. Like it looks funny. It looks like endearing. I really want to watch it because I love Jack Black. Yeah. But like in the whole movie, he talks in like this like I don't know if it's a Polish or a Swedish accent, but it it's it's fabulous, and I need to watch it. All right. Yeah. Sounds cool. Yeah. I gotta say, man. So far, Netflix been pumping out gold. Yeah, they are. Like lately. Yeah. I wonder if the song will keep going. Oh, it probably will. No, what, I, what I've seen of this game, yeah, that song's gonna go. That song's going forever. Until we get to the next Bennett Foddy. Taunts us moment. <laughs> taunts us moment? Like, in his design documents, he's like, alright, this is a taunt point? Yeah. Oh, I guarantee it is. This is where I taunt the player with some pseudo-intellectual nonsense about never giving up. And the joys of failure to uh, success. Oh. Is he saying, I'm going where the weather suits my clothes? Um. Going down, Cap. Mm. Oh. It's weird because like this game requires a certain level of momentum. Uh huh. And like if you lose that momentum, it's super hard to regain it. Yeah. Like this part here definitely feels like one of those like you need momentum to get. Oh, come on! <laughs> now you do the push off. You bitch. Oh no. Okay. Okay. It's fine. You know what's amazing? Hmm? This game got made. You know what's more amazing? What? People play this game. Yeah? Like, why? People know that this game is intentionally designed well, you to know, be absolutely frustrating. It's, 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 uh, it's the Fisher Complex. The Fisher Complex? Yeah, it, it's, it's something that I created back in 2006. It's a working theory. Uh, known as the Fisher Complex. Okay. Where it doesn't matter how hard a game is, it doesn't matter how badly designed it is, it's a matter that you can sit there and hold it over people's head to say, I beat this. Hmm. I did this, and you couldn't. Because, uh, you know, our friend, he loves to say that about things. Yeah. Oh, come on. Oh, it's so hard to get and, re- and really, that's what this is. It's just a matter of being able to sit there and tell people that you were able to beat the game and they couldn't. And yeah. It, and it's it, it's incredibly frustrating. It's incredibly, like, skill challenging. But it is designed in a way that makes it so that way people who finish the game feel accomplished by the fact that it was so damn hard. I guess. Yeah. <clears throat> and since it has such a low price point, it's like... People can sit there and justify, you know, oh, this is only eight dollars. Right. So whatever. If I don't beat the game, that's fine. It was only eight bucks. Oh boy. Oh boy, what? I just want to get back up there. Come on. No, stop. What are you doing? That's another thing too, is like you sit there and you do like the launch off and you're like, this is how I do it every time. And then it like launches you a different right. way. Yeah. It's like, uh, who was it? Markiplier or Jack or somebody was saying that like, dependent upon your screen position is where your X and Y position for your hammer changes. And so your, your sensitivity suddenly will like 
you'll be moving and then all of a sudden you'll hit a point and your hammer will touch it and you won't move your hand but the hammer will move and like mm. flick you and fuck you by putting you in weird positions yeah which is something interesting like if you watch like some of the speedrunners mm -hmm. like you can see they do this thing where they like let the hammer float uh, in a certain position and they don't actually extend for the next ridge until like they until they're just about to t hit it yeah just like that kind of well, I Except meant like how the cam how the hammer suddenly will like flick you across the, the screen because your camera is shifting position there's some weirdness like when you get to the space near the guy too which is super weird mm hmm like you can see it like you see it like it darts back and forth. Yep. Like how like sometimes like I just want to bring the hammer in and other times like it darts back and forth like that. So from looking at that, like the way that the the like, uh, it's stuck on your hammer is stuck between the rock yeah. and the paddle. Uh, looking at how the uh, little mouse cursor is reacting to you. Mm -hmm. uh, it looks like it wants to stay at a set degrees outward from your character. But the thing is, is since your X and Y position can move constantly, if you force it in, it'll bring the mouse cursor in, but then it'll slowly try to push back out and reinterpolate the distance between the outer circle that it wants to be at. Yeah. And so that, that and if you exceed it, like if you go from like, you know, if zero X and Y position is in the center of his chest, um, if you accelerate or, you know, uh, go back from negative to positive uh, it will automatically reset the, the position of the no mouse cursor to the, the furthest point changes. from the positive or John negative Bench side <sighs> nope alright buddy you want to do another episode uh, I think I'm good. All right. Well, everybody, this is us playing uh, Getting Over It, and Steve is definitely over it right now. And uh, I hope you guys have a good one. And uh, hopefully all your failures become successes. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye.